there's a whole group of cicadas called the double drummers. Yes, the double drummers got an, quite an amazing s- song. It's very electric. It's got strong modulating and pulsing elements to it. It's like an electric saw, a real high, high-end wine. It, it's very metallic. Um, it's about as loud as they get. The eastern double drummer is Australia's largest cicada, about five centimetres or a bit, a bit over that in body length. And they're also a very, very wide cicada. In fact, another species of double drummer, I think, has the widest head of any Australian insect. Um, so they're, they're a chunky beast. They do look like a little bit of a buff head. I have to say, I was looking them up on the internet in preparation for this interview, and they are a sight to behold. Yes, they're pretty spectacular uh, with their real reddish-brown coloration, and some of the species have white markings, others have black markings. In fact, another name for the eastern double drummer is a Union Jack because of the distinctive markings on the thorax. So. And this is just one eastern double drummer trying to drum up some female attention. It's an absolutely obnoxious sound for us. The sound is so dense, I did a count, and it has about 220 or more pulses per second. Per second. It's so dense. It's like a wall of sound. I have to slow it down so much just so that you can hear the pulses. And actually, each one of these pulses you can hear is actually two pushed closely together amazing creatures. A lot of Australia has double drummers. The eastern double drummer, the desert double drummer, the orange drummer, which is a mini double drummer. So there's quite a few double drummers out there now. Does it also make you feel slightly like you're researching in a Dr Seuss novel? I like that aspect of it, I think. You know, we like to do things that are unique and and interesting in life, and and I guess cicadas are are what's really grabbed me. (laughs) 